I came into the United States with a, a conditional green card in 2018 September. Right. And and um, 2019 uh, we got divorced, but we have a three-year-old kid. I mean, baby girl. Okay. Right. In the system. So I filed. 2019, I, I mean, 2020, you I think so, I asked for a number of conditions. Right. And uh, before then, I was given uh, an extension. For, right. Is it eight months or 12 months, I guess? I'm mm-hmm. not really sure. Which, uh, which left. And uh, last year, they gave me another 24, another 12 months or 18 months extension. Great. And I, the last, the last response I got from USCIS, is uh, as of August 30, 2021, that they've scheduled me for an interview, and I've not heard anything from them okay. since now, up to now. All right, so and, and, I, and uh, you're sure they didn't schedule it yet? Oh, no, I always check it. Okay. I always check. When did, you, when did you get your conditional green card? When did you enter the United States? Uh, 2018, what? September 2018. Okay, so 90 days before September 2018, would be yeah. June to July, July to August. Sometime in June of 2023, if you don't get scheduled for an interview, you will have had a, been a permanent resident for four years, nine months, and three days. And if okay. you haven't heard anything between now and June, you'll file your citizenship. But you're I still a resident. Yeah, in June, some 90 days before the, your five-year anniversary. So oh. you know, I am sure that they will schedule you between now and June. Um, okay. You're a permanent resident. You can keep renewing your green card. I'm confident you will win your case because you have a child with this, uh, with your ex-wife. So I'm not yeah. worried that you're not going to win your case. Um, so I would just wait it out. And if you don't hear anything by June, just do your citizenship because you'll be eligible to do it. All right, great. All right. Thank you so much. I really All appreciate right. it. Okay, good luck.